Hi, Vita. How are you doing today? I'm great, Brian. Good. So I'm going to ask you a few questions today about your procedure that you had done. Okay. So you had the all-on-four treatment. Yes, I did. Correct. So why did you want to have the surgery done? Well, because my teeth were falling apart. I had broken teeth. I had discoloration on my teeth. Um, it was a fighting battle. I just The doctor told me you're going to have to either get dentures or you're going to have to go with something else, which the something else was this. And you chose wisely. I did. Right, I did. <laughs> what kind of problems did you have prior to the surgery? Well, I had health problems. I came in to get my teeth done and because I was scared to death and I forgot to take my medicine before I came in, my blood pressure shot up really high. And Dr. Malik felt that it would be better for me to go to my regular doctor and be checked before we did this procedure. And I went to the doctor and I was checked and she said, it's fine, go ahead, you were just scared, you didn't take your medicine, and it's fine. So did you have any uh, problems eating prior to the surgery? Oh gosh, yeah, I had a lot of cavities in the back of my mouth and I couldn't eat candies. And I just had a lot of sensitivity. Sensitivity to hot and cold? Oh gosh, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So do you have any sensitivity now? Oh, no. No? No. Did you have any trouble speaking or chewing? Since I got the... Uh, After, uh, prior to the surgery? Uh, prior to the surgery? No, I, w I was pretty good with speaking, and, and uh, but I didn't smile a whole lot. Didn't smile a lot. Not like you do now. Right. Were you ever subconscious about your parents prior to the surgery? Of course. Of course. I found that I tried to not smile, and if I did, I'd look down or away. But now I don't do that. Not anymore. Were you uh, worried about the, the surgery? I'm scared to death. <laughs> yes, I was worried. <laughs> did you uh, did you talk to anybody about uh, the surgery prior? Uh, maybe we had it done? Yes, I did. Um, I was uh, went to a former client, and we had a luncheon together, and she told me about it. And then there was another lady that I spoke with on the telephone many, many times. And she also had had it done, and she just, she was really my deciding factor. If they can do this, I can do it. Did it make you feel better about having the surgery done, a little bit more Absolutely. comfortable? Absolutely, because I felt at the office they could tell me, but they really hadn't been through it. And I wanted to talk to somebody who actually had done it. And been through what you're about to go through. Exactly. How did the surgery change your life? Well, I, I'm a lot more, um, I, I'll smile a lot more. I'm not self-conscious about my smile at all. I never wore lipstick before in my life, and I found that I am wearing lipstick occasionally now. I always felt that it would just draw attention. How uh, was your recovery process after the, the surgery? Oh, it was fine. I had no pain, whatever. I, would, I did bruise a little bit, but I was um, no pain. No okay. pain. And how long was the healing process? Probably before I could really chew anything, maybe yeah. give or take a month. Would you recommend the surgery to anyone else who had similar issues as you? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. It it's, makes a world of difference. And how was your experience with the with our office? Uh, it was great. I really, anything I wanted or any questions I had, everybody went out of their way to help me. Good. And what bothered you most about the procedure? I guess fear of the unknown. Fearful of what, what's the finished product going to look like. I mean, even the temporaries look great, but fearful. Because it's a big, a big different, big step from what you, you have naturally to go into something so completely different. different. Mm -hmm. Have your friends and our family noticed any changes? Well, I didn't tell anybody that I was going to have it done. And I've had people ask me, did you, did, you, did you change your makeup? Or they don't know exactly what's different, but they know something's different. And what changes uh, have they noticed? Uh, probably that I'm always smiling, <laughs> more so than before. Do you have any words for anybody who uh, is thinking about having the procedure, who's watching this now? Um, any words of encouragement or any uh, advice that you'd like to give them? If you're thinking about it and you talk to the office staff already and you want to talk to a person who's really had it done, by all means go ahead and do it because that'll be your deciding factor. Once you weigh all of the
pros and cons, you will decide that the best thing, what's best for you. And I felt what was best for me was to go ahead and do it. Rita, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. You're quite welcome. All right. Bye. Bye.